Golani In the streets of the East Dish, that's where you can find me Yeah, yeah Hey, what's up, boy? It's your boy, Bill Nye. I'm out here in Monday, in Del Paso Heights. I'm doing a photo shoot for my EP, Big Boy. Big Boy is a single hey, for my new EP. Actually entitled hey, Big Boy. Hey, so it's kind of ironic. Hey, but yeah, hey, uh, what inspired what me doing, about it was just hey, really my surroundings. Hey, where I came from. Oh, from. Give a fuck. See, I made Big Bully, really I want to say about really a year, a year and a half ago, and yeah, I was just, I was just yeah, in my, in my really room, and I was just thinking, like, man, this shit is tight. <laughs> just thinking, like, man, like, if I, if I think this tight, somebody, somebody else might think it's tight. And I was like, man, hold up. And then I, I just sat it on the back burner for a long time, you feel me? And then, and then, like, my, my boy, you know, my boy, he, he told me, like, he was like, man, he was like, man, you can you to this shit, man, you need to do this shit to the fullest of your motherfucking potential. And I was like, yeah, let's go. Do you feel real when you thugging in the field? Shit get real, shit get real, yeah. Yeah, you know, for real, I just really, you know, I was just sitting back in my house, right? I actually wrote this one, you feel me? I didn't. I didn't freestyle it. That, this was a song that really just, that I knew that I was at my peak, that I just really needed to just, just really focus, 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 and focus. And, you know, I did, you know, I was like, I was like, let me write, man, because when I was freestyling, I'm like, I feel like I wasn't going to my full potential, you feel me? And that's what I'm doing. This shit is tight. I just wanted to feel some good shit, you feel me? Because I feel like, I feel like I was making too much love souls, you know, more, more, like more hate souls, and, you know, I just wanted to, just have some shit that, you know, in the East just slap me, you know, have some shit in the East just slap me, you know, like, it's like, I'm like, everybody can vibe to me, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna help, cause it comes from my heart and my soul, you know, it's like, I'm gonna at first, you know, I was like, damn, this shit cool, this shit cool. And then my cousin, he told me, he was like, man, bro, we need to go do this shit, bro. We, we need to go to the studio, man. We need to redo this shit, man. How this shit looking? Like, sound dope as fuck. I know y'all like it. I know y'all love it. You feel me? Like, we just go, we gonna do it. We buying it. Like, what I was thinking about, though, I was thinking about, like, man, I, I wanna I wanna make a dope-ass fucking harmony, bro. I wanna make this shit the same. Like, to, to where I just go up and then just go down with it and just... Let me just do it, you know. I was just like, man, let me get some. Uh, let me put some real dope ass lyrics on it. Like, I was like, I was like, I said, my life is in shambles. <laughs> like, you know, I was like, okay, just coming from my soul, my heart. You know? Life is in shambles. I'm doing my best to assemble. Hard times, yeah. Hard times, yeah. One through it right. See, hard times. Self explanatory. Hard times. You know, I was in two years ago. You know, hard times. Like, you know, I just lost my, lost my job a couple of, uh, a couple of days before my, my first daughter was born. And it made a, had a real impact on me. Like, that was the last song that I freestyled. Like, because it was just that. Like, it just felt that authentic to me. And, like, I hope y'all feel the same way, though. Like, it's just. I feel like everybody has hard times, and you know, I feel like y'all can relate to my, to my situation. You know? We can just, you know, support each other. Listen to me, you know, that's important. That's my When you're feeling down and out, like, when you're feeling like there's nobody, nobody by your side, you know, I'm there. I really go, bitch. Yeah, you really know this. Ooh, we tired of being villains, yeah. Mass killer. Hey, hey, treat us the same, yeah, yeah. This is my day, yeah, yeah. Every dog has his day, yeah, yeah. And this is my day, yeah. Ever since a pup, bitch, been down on my luck, bitch. <laughs> Nah, you know, uh, villains, you know, that was, that was a real, that was a real, you know, authentic song, you know, like, I was talking about my times in prison and shit, like, you know, like, I was just, I was in that really struggling, like, I didn't have shit, bro, like, I was really, like, the police was fucking me up, like, coming to my son is fucking me up, like, it's on some, on some real grimy 
shit. You feel me? I feel like I should just put that I had to, you know, channel that in some way, in some positive way. You know? So I can be positive. You know, positivity is the key. Though. I said, ever since a pup bitch been down on my luck, bitch, I got snitched on by the bitch like it's the fuck. I was talking about this, this dice bitch, man. Like, she really, she really gave me grind me up. Like, she didn't have shit, man. She didn't have nothing. Like, you feel me? And I, I was like, man, okay, I'm, I'm flocking right now. You know, if you don't know what flocking is, I was hitting licks and shit. You feel me? Like, Put you on, you feel me? Let's, let's go ahead. 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 We tired of living life as an outsider. Got me feeling like the ghost rider. Yeah, like I ain't got no soul. That incarceration, it took a big toll. Yeah. See, this one right here, this is really a real delicate one. Like, I really, like, I really wrote this. I wrote part of the song while I was in prison. Like, the chorus, I wrote part of the chorus. It was actually a verse, but I turned it into a chorus, and then I just started writing from that. So, and it, it, it was really, it really derived from my, from my baby mama, you feel me, like, it was going through some things, you feel me, and I was just feeling left out, I was feeling like an outsider, I felt like I was underappreciated, you feel me, but, you know, we, you know, we, we working things out right now, you feel me, but I feel like everybody that's going through similar situations, they can relate to you know, that's, that's what I am, you know, I'm a preacher, like, this whole shit, like, I really wrote it while I was in prison, I just added little things, like when I said, I need some pussy now, I ain't even know that, but I see the bigger picture like a Kodak, you feel me, like, bitches left me, man, I was in there with nothing, I ain't got nothing, I ain't got no JPs, no packages, niggas selling their packages, you feel me, $25, you feel me, I ain't nothing,